Okay, here we are in the music room today. I'm about to do the unboxing and unveiling of the Unicorn, the first ever Hatfield feud in Lefty. He said he was only going to make 25 of these. About my first Hatfield 18 years ago, I got Hatfield special number four. And now, all this time later, I decided to get a feud in Lefty. There's the packaging from Arthur Hatfield. Let's see what we get. Got her open and see what happens. Okay, here we go. It's unboxed. Comes in a shiny new case. Let's see what we got. There she is. The Hatfield Feud. Arthur Hatfield. He's from Kentucky. And his family may or may have not have partaken in the Hatfield and McCoy feud, but the Spando is what that's all about. Got me some notes. The thing about this one is, as you can see, it's a lefty. And out of the, I gotta see how many feuds there are. When, when I ordered this, it was gonna be number 12. He said in his lifetime he was only gonna make 25. And this is the only one in Lefty. So it's the only one of its kind. Gold hardware. It's got all the different feud inlays, the burning house, uh, the other house, the pistol, the pig, which started it all, cross rifles, states of Kentucky and West Virginia, I think. I gotta read up on my feud. A hanging noose, some bullet holes, and the feud. The thing that's really special about it, now this is a maple banjo. The thing that's really special about it is the back painting of the Hatfields and McCoys. What a beautiful job of pan painting that is over a maple. Maple neck, beautiful maple neck. Wow, what a piece of art. Gorgeous. Well done, Arthur. Let's get this baby tuned up and see what she'll do. What an amazing banjo. So that's the unboxing of the Lefty Feud. Hope you all enjoyed it. Here's his note. Hi, and thanks for the purchase. Sorry if the setup is not the greatest, but I can't play a lefty even enough to see how it sounds. I can only get the action height and head tension as good as I can. Thanks again, Arthur. 
I'm sure it'll be just fine, Arthur.